Welcome to our tutorial about the Application Menu. The Application Menu is available when you click the large A in the upper left corner. Click here to see documents that are currently open and also recently opened documents. Documents can be sorted by ordered lists, by access date, size, type, and so on. We can also choose to view the document list with small icons, small images, and large images. When I mouse over a document, I get a flyout with a larger image preview, the document's location, the date the document was modified, and so on. Currently, nine documents appear in my list of documents. We can change the number of documents that appear here. Let's go to Options. There's a button down at the bottom of the menu. Click on that. Go to the Open and Save tab. Here I change the number of recently used files that will display in the application menu. Let's change it to 6. File Open. Here we specify the number of recently used files visible in the File menu. Let's click Apply and OK. Let me show you the documents under the File menu. Expand the Quick Access Toolbar and select Show Menu Bar. And here's where I see the seven recently opened documents. I can choose from any of those. In my case, five of those appear below my recording screen, so you won't be able to see them, but they are there. Let's go back to the application menu, click on the big A. And now, as you see, there's only six documents visible in this list. The pin icon next to each document will keep that document in its current position in the list. Let me open one more document. Now let's go back to the application menu. Drawing 6 still appears at the bottom of my list. And that's because I pinned it down there. At the top of the application menu is a search field. Let's type line in the search field, for example. Now matching commands appear in a list. I'm going to choose the line tool, and now it's active. I can drop a line in the drawing area. To exit the tool, press Escape on the keyboard. We've also got the option to create a tag for tools. Let's open up the workspace switch and scroll down to Customize. I can also go to the command line and type CUI and press Enter. That's another way to open the Customize dialog window. Under the command list, I'm going to type Line. And here's the Line tool. Let's select it. Now let's select the Tag field. And let's type some text here, for example, 001. Let's click OK. Then click Apply and click OK again. Now when I mouse over the Line tool, 001 is the visible tag. If I type 001 in the search field in the application menu, the line tool comes up. Let's press Escape to exit the line tool. And this concludes our overview of the application menu. We're going to continue exploring the AutoCAD 2012 interface in our next tutorials.